Hi everyone, I've just popped on today to show you a needle book that I've been making uh, for a swap with a friend. Uh, I won't be posting uh, this uh, video until uh, the lady has actually got it, uh, but I just thought I would do a wee film on, it, on what I've done. First of all, I got some wadding. Uh, it, a piece uh, a, a piece and cut a piece this size out and covered it with some lovely cream cotton fabric then I had this fabric uh, which was one piece so I cut the pieces out of it put them on the inside and then put this braid Round it to tidy it all up and I thought that would make a nice a good inside for a needle book. Then I added these wee bits of felt and put these little pearl tip pins in. On the outside I went round it, I edged it all with some narrow white, uh, no cream narrow gathered lace. Then went over the top of that with this lovely uh, lace here, this lace trim with little diamantes on it that I got out of uh, my subscription box from Amanda. That's uh, Amanda's uh, lace closet. These were also, these pink daisies, were also in the subscription box. They're absolutely lovely. And then this Venice rosebud trim. I got this off uh, the lovely Brenda Exeter. Then I had these wooden letters and a Painted them white, then edged them with the uh, narrow uh, cream lace, same as round the edge, and then cut out some of the lovely rosebuds from the Venice trim. This here I got from Esme's Crafty Me shop. I absolutely adore this trim. Like little rose cameos, it's really lovely. And the butterflies were also in my subscription box from Amanda. Aren't they lovely? And that's the back. Finished it off with this trim. Went round it, top and bottom. I really like it. Then this pink and cream, this was also from Brenda Exeter, the lovely Brenda. So, and that's the cover. And I just added these ties, these seam binding ties in, uh, I think it's cameo beige. Cameo, cameo beige. And uh, white, did some little finger bows just to hide where I'd glued them on and that's the cover. The little insert, <coughs> the two little um, pages for the insert. I did them, made them out of the same wadding and cream fabric, basic cream fabric and uh, a lot of the stuff was I had a moustache, this braid, uh, this I also I think I got that off Etsy. These larger pink bows were in my subscription box from Amanda's Lace Closet. And again, one of my favourite trims here from the lovely Brenda. That's a little pocket with a piece of felt in that I cut and put some uh, sewing needles and some pins. In the back, another little pocket. And that's got the tape measure in. I had these little bows in moustache.
Then I had some lace here. This is a bit stretchy. So I thought I'd put two pieces across. That'll hold the spools. And then made a little pocket here for the scissors. Finished it all off with some a couple of daisies, some white ones, some pink ones. Then added this tassel. I actually think I got this from the Crafting Insomniacs, this tassel, quite a while ago. And added it with a bit of lace and then finished it off with another uh, little um, pink bow I had in moustache. And that's it and I really really hope the lady likes it when she gets it. And it all fits in rather nice and neatly. And I just finished it, like I say, with the seam binding to fasten it all up. And that's my needle book. I hope you like it, but more importantly, I hope the lady likes it when she gets it. Thank you for watching, and I'll talk to you again very soon. Thank you now. Bye.